Numbers versus Zamba. Now you might be thinking numbers versus Zamba. That's gonna I be negative money. Don't I, do that. No, no, no. <laughs> Wait, you might be thinking numbers versus Zamba. I see that every week. But actually, last time I believe numbers beat Zamba. Oh, numbers. So. All right. Was it last time? Very recently, Numbers beat Zamba. No. Yeah, last time, Numbers beat Zamba, which like never happens. Yeah. So Numbers has kind of been on a tear lately, you know? If, if you're excited to see the, the New York OGs show these new kids that we still got it, type an exploit match, you know? Yeah, donate to, you're not even really donating. It's not even really your own money. You're just kind of putting it in the chat yeah. to um, put free money from essentially nowhere. No uh. stress on you. Just one thing, but you know who is stressed? John Numbers, because he's got a Rob that's keeping him on ledge. Never mind. Look at that yeah. fair. John's out. He says, look, if there's one place where John Numbers is comfortable, it is at the edge of the stage. Has an excellent mix-up game. Um, with that said, going to have to take this um, Rob stock relatively soon. Already at 142%, so looking pretty good positionally. Uh, misses that roll right there. Okay, quick down to dash tag. Really excellent by Zamba. Does do that quite a bit. And a down smash to cover the landing. Still not enough just yet with the deep breathing active. We are going to live a decent amount of time there. Yeah, I definitely think the deep breathing Ooh. might have been in effect right there. Knowing Rob was going to dash in, great preemptive F tilt. Yeah, and that move is active. So Numbers was able to get that out, and even though the move is out already, covered Rob dashing in. Ooh, oh, we're getting big damage. We're yeah. at, ooh, missed a catch on that landing right there with the up tilt. Unfortunate for Numbers in the corner once again, but going to be able to get out or at least in a better position here. Okay, missed double jump there by Numbers. In the corner once more. Ooh, great late fair to catch the ledge snap there. Dead. Yeah, that's going to be really free when we've hit us to recover that low without a jump. You can just kind of react and start the up B. And now, this is where... So, I feel like Zamba has been able to win so much against John Numbers because he's been able to kind of consistently uh -oh, get some cheese. Oh. Accidentally full hopping right there. I the, think the, the hitbox was the different hitbox in there rather than the one that sends really far up, mm -hmm. which is why Zamba did a full hop instead of a short hop. So, um, yeah, really, really... Uh, it's a little bit of a mess up there by Zamba, and it is being uh, quite a bit costly at the moment. Uh, really, Numbers has been... Oh, you're dead. Okay, not quite. Um, no deep breathing active there, so not going to die just yet, uh, is Zamba. But very near death at the moment. That pressure on shield. The Reaper Aerial is so safe when deep breathing is active. And this is the thing. If you can avoid, like, the Rob combos like Numbers has, then it's just a constant state of Rob being in disadvantage. And Numbers has been so on point in the chase down. Even with Rob's ability to, like, hover, he's just waiting for the landings and punishing then, you know, being super patient. Yeah, I think what's the craziest thing about how John has been playing the stock is John was at, like, 45% at one point and got all the way. Oh, you're dead. <gasps> where's, the, where's the side B? Uh, I'm not sure. I feel like that was definitely a side Where? B. Okay. Well, let's say Zama at the very least does have John in the corner of the stage now. Still good positionally, and you are already kind of on borrowed time here at 200%. That fair is going to be just enough. This is a huge stock for Zama. You need to get this stock off soon. You cannot let John get 200% here. John with a good little bit of momentum is so, so scary. Ooh, okay. That laser is going to come out. Help out Zama there. Numbers does not drift in, knowing that bear is going to be coming. And now deep breathing is active. So scary for Zamba here. Ooh, oh, big, huge damage, 74. This is the exact opposite of what you wanted as Zamba in this stock. Huge amount of damage already done. You need to get the stock off early. Not gonna combo though. Okay. Numbers very good at yeah. mashing, yeah. <laughs> good, goodness gracious, Numbers having a time in the player cam. Um, but that is still not ideal for Zamba here. Obviously you are Rob, you know, Rob does have those zero deaths does have ledge traps that can just kill you at ludicrously early percents. However, um, still a mountain to climb at the moment. And John has the ability to heal. F tilt. And there oh. you go. That is the power of deep breathing. You saw before at 140 that you did yeah. not kill. Yeah. At one like 10, it killed this time with deep breathing. And Zamba looking a little frustrated in the player game. I mean, it's crazy. You know, he had such a dominant streak over numbers, then mm -hmm. lost last time, and now he's down 0 1. He could lose again. Goodness great. Before the hit, 85%. Yeah. Goodness gracious. Against, yeah, one of the heavier characters in this yeah. game. All right. Yeah, that's the power of deep breathing. I wonder what percent you have to fair Pikachu to die. <laughs> or, oh, like Pichu? Pichu? Oh, you just yeah, die. <laughs> you, you get hit at zero. You just explode. Um, with that said, though, quick damage for John coming out already. Nice uh, combo there with the up air fair. However, uh, Zamba responding into in kind with some combos of his own. 
Nice at catching that air dodge there. That wrap up air, super long lingering. Dangerous position there for Zama. That could have been a spike. Okay. Nice wait by John there. Um, waiting to the very, very last moment to do that up B. Yeah, it's been so crucial, Numbers' recovery mix-up game, mm -hmm. because that's like the biggest way to let a lead slip away from you is Rob off stage, pressuring you at ledge, game like a down, down air early side beacon. But Numbers has been so tricky. I mean, every time he recovers a different way, and Zamba's not been able to catch on to it once. That's a dead right. Rob. And if, if, if Numbers does have one strength, it really is the ability to mix up so much off the stage, what he has been known for for so many years uh, through Smash 4 and Ultimate. Um, and again, we're seeing a dangerously similar situation for Zamba here, already taking that 54%, but that's a huge down smash to not take too much. 54%, not nearly as much of a margin as a, like 100% margin that he had taken in that game number two. Um, however, John still in a good position, has Rob in the corner, but Zamba reversing the situation. This is where you don't want to be. Yeah. Every Rob there, probably going to do a Z drop. Uh, yeah. A Z drop there, looking for one thing and one thing only. I mean, that's, uh, Zamba's keeping it up, you know. Ooh. Oh. And the air dodger on top of all of that. And that's that huge. That cuts off all this momentum numbers has been building over this game in the last one. Yeah. And you, oh, goodness. I thought really the, the gyro's going to hit uh, Zamba there and lead to a combo. Uh, however, uh, what, what, what's interesting here is that uh, Numbers really has been super consistent in terms of his gyro play, right? Uh, misses it out on the there, but yeah, you're seeing immediately up throwing it. That is just super good against Rob in general. Zama has to be incredibly careful with how he recovers back to the stage, but delayed Nair, super good there to get uh, out of disadvantage. However, Numbers, once again, catching Zamba in shield, grabs, Zamba jumps in the corner, got to be able to throw a situation again. An up air, looking for numbers to fast fold. Doesn't end up choosing that option this time. Deep breathing's gonna allow numbers to live though. Yeah, really scary deep breathing, or pre like doing the move that high. Almost died for it, and wow. Good idea with that F smash. A little bit off though. And in the corner at the moment is John. Has to take this stock off here if something is going to happen. Already at that 150% margin, that bear is pretty safe. Even if the strong hit doesn't hit your block um, and move Rob away. Again, that, that is still a relatively safe move. Okay, that's a huge parry for John. Still not killing. That is the power of deep breathing. Goodness gracious. We are at 190% and the move is not killing. Oh, look at that. Tomahawk ledge option right there. No, I have not seen Zamba do that once. Numbers definitely not ready for it. Oh, we... Oh, goodness. And one thing I will say about Zamba is that his survivability this set has been really good. Literally 200% twice already in these two games. However, we're going to need to see a big response from John just to get past Zamba here. Oh, looking for the air dodge down. Doesn't end up working that time around. Trying to catch the jump in. Nice air dodge by numbers to get back into the ground. Oh, scary situation to be in. No jump there for Zamba. Ends up working out, though. I mean, Zamba's kind of staying in this really, like... That's oh. hilarious. That's so funny. <laughs> Let's go, Rob. I wonder if that was a true combo. It, or, looked, it looked dangerously close. Yeah, or numbers might have been like instantly pressing side B or something. Let's see if we can see yeah. bubble. All right. Numbers didn't press looked a button. really uh, didn't press a button or looked really close to being in stun still. It uh, no, that looks like that's the start of the tumble animation. Yeah, I think that was the start of tumble, but. What I was going to say, again, how uh, Zamba was able to initiate that kill is when Numbers is at this percent where he needs to make a comeback, you know that he's going to be fishing to get a deep breathing going. And so Zamba stayed really close to him, but not like right next to him to avoid Wii Fit's really solid uh, uh, options up close, but still bait out and punish if there's a deep breathing. And because of that, he was able to gyro the deep breathing and get that last stock. Ooh, that's a huge reversal for John there. You're seeing 65%. Ludicrous amounts of damage. Nice high recovery by Zama there. You have to do that against Weefa Trainer when they are pressuring you to the side of the stage as Rob. Really the only way to get out of that corner there. You do have some mix, but really going high is your best option against Weefa Trainer. Ooh, that gyro. Uh, John not timing uh, his grab correctly. Such a scary situation to be in. But Zama opts to relent the pressure off the gyro and try and cover a roll. Doesn't work out for him there. Nice parry by John. He's really on top of these parries thus far. Ooh. In the corner once again. Okay, quick dash check by John to get Zamba back into the corner. This is a big ledge trap for John. 
Yeah, you were staying on top of those parries, even able to parry the fair. You know, parrying the nair is one thing, and you can react to that, but you have to read numbers landing yes. with a fair right there. That's showing, uh, that's showing that, or have to read Zamba lane with the fair, excuse me. That's showing numbers has a really good download right now on Zamba. <laughs> Ooh. Wow, I thought it was going to be a positive trade for numbers, at the very least, you know, a neutral trade. Um, but in fact, Zama ends up taking the stock and living a full charge sun at like 140%. It's huge with that fair off the top after deep breathing, going to be able to take it. Numbers right back in this game. And that was so vital because you could have easily seen kind of what happened last game where Zamba just kept tacking on percent because numbers yeah. was trying to get the kill. But instead, able to get it really even right here and good usage. He's been using that give attack super well to punish these landing aerials that Rob like to do just like that. Yeah, and, the, and really numbers has kind of been mixing up so much sludge. And I think normally, I don't think we've really seen a single get up attack that whole set. Really numbers changing it up as we speak. However, in disadvantage, this is really Weave Trainer's biggest weakness is coming back down to the floor. For disadvantage off the stage is really good, but landing can be really tough. And Zamba's been taking full advantage. Another parry by numbers. So on top of those landings that Zamba is doing. Ooh, I think numbers was looking for a bear there. Um, and would have very came very close to taking that stock as well. Cats landing again in numbers. So on top of the landing game at the moment on Rob. Yeah, Zamba, I feel like, needs to just give numbers space when landing and stop trying to land on top of him because either numbers catches the nair before it comes out or parries the landing aerial. So Zamba definitely needs to mix up how he's landing because he just keeps getting punished for it. His death. Nice. And Zamba really is, I think, uh, not necessarily like, innovative, but kind of one of the few Robs that do see use those jab lock combos. Um, not, not many Robs are really going about doing that. So impressed by Zamba, the awareness to continue doing that. That's so, so difficult to deal with on shield, especially like, with a character like Weaver where you don't have great out of shield. Zamba has John in the corner, but John, potential here to take the stock. That Sun, not going to be enough just yet. Zamba once again had was in the corner, fights out. Looking for an up smash on the landing. Didn't end up working out. That air dodge. Numbers not fighting. After all the top, still not enough. And this is so tense right here. Oh, details. Oh, looking for that fair. Not going to be enough. John's after on the roll read. Oh! Off oh, the top, oh. we're dead. Yeah. Did that... Zamba dropped shield, yeah, thinking numbers was going to come up with an aerial. Roll back, hit it. That was right when he dropped shield. Yeah. I'm surprised it didn't parry or something. That, that was that was so close. That must have been very close to the window. Boom. Yeah, that was just as as Zamba just. dropped that shield. Wow. Uh, that poke? That, yeah, that, I was no! gonna say. I, I think he poked because war crimes. Where where was Rob poking out? I think it Tell me. Tell me, chat. Look at look at Zamba's reaction. He's like, what just hey, happened? Hey. You know what this is? <laughs> you know what this is? A Rob is big moment. Yeah. Rob is big. I think Rob, Rob might be big, big after that. Yeah, Rob that is real big. big. Now, honestly, that was a, is a valid... The, Rob's normally don't actually have a valid complaint saying Rob is big. That one, I'll give you. I'll that give you crazy. that one. That was kind of insane. Yeah, I, I was like, I don't think he dropped shield, but it did it. I was, I was like, he had to have. It, yeah, was was full, it was full shield. Yeah, I'm like, that's good. upsetting. That's gotta be a terrible way to lose a set. Golly tamale, Jesus.